What's up guys, it's Trickster Artist sitting here bringing you another Will You Press The Button? Now, once again, we are back with some more unrestricted questions. You know the format. Ten minutes, let's go. Let's go. Will You Press The Button? You can have sex with Danny Bridge. I don't know who the fuck that is. But you get trolled hard every day for the rest of your life. I will not since I do not even know who the fuck this guy is. Uh, you know bad okay w you will receive oh for fuck's sake uh, okay you want to play that way well i'm out of fucker good okay okay you will receive a pet ghost of any historical figure of your choosing but it's too spooky for you meaning i'll get scared of it every goddamn time and to be honest unless the fake canon is true and arturi is a woman i and, Ar and King Arthur was actually a woman, I will not do that. Because, come on, guys. Guys. Guys, like, come on. Fate Cannon, Fate Cannon is best cannon. No, shut up. No, shut up. I'm not a pervert who wants to see a gender bent King Arthur naked. Shut up. Um. Come on. Click. Okay, there we go. You can manipulate. <laughs> God damn it! You can manipulate your dreams so anything can happen, but if you die in your dreams, you die. <laughs> manipulate. Fucking hell, come on, man! Manipulate. Manipul. What the fuck? Okay! No, no, fuck it, fuck it. I'll click it because it's funny. And... <laughs> yeah, lucid dreaming is good. I mean, you can make it so that you can't be killed, ever. You can't be killed in your dream, ever. Like, there's a loophole to this kind of shit. Kind of shit that the people don't specify, so... Eh. You can become a tank whenever you want, but you have to kiss Justin Bieber. Fuck no. Fuck him. Fuck his fan. Fuck his fans, they don't know good music. Shut up. Okay. Okay, and I've triggered a lot of people in the comments. <laughs> Good luck! Okay. You go you become extreme, uh, extremely talented at something of your choosing, but it's your only talent and you're not good at anything else. I mean... No. Oh. Like, sure, people would press the button, but then again, what would happen? They'd become fucking paraplegic. They wouldn't... They would lose the skills that they had. You know, most of the skills that he had, like walking or something like that. But, you know, eh. Okay. You gain immortality, but you must kill humans to add them to your own lifespan. Now, this is a situation of whether you are in the gray, the black, or the white. Because, as for me, I am willing to kill people to gain, your, uh, to gain immortality. But... But, I'll only do it if the person is bad. As in, like, a major fucking asshole that the world will, like, most likely be, like, praising me for it. Because, like, oh, hey, I killed a bad dude. You know, like, Osama Bin Laden. I think he's already... No, wait, no, he's already dead. Shit. Um, Keemstar. Uh, uh, maybe even say oh i don't know justin bieber or isis i mean come on come on guys come on guys but eh, yeah i press the button but i bet there are some like living pacifists who don't want to do that even though they're like the fucking scum of the earth which i grant you goodwill but at the same time you're fucking naive you can kill everyone you want without punishment, but everyone you know thinks that you're a horrible person. Nah. I mean, some people think of me as decent, but I don't want to lose that, too. Plus, come on, guys. Horribleness doesn't attract fans. Fans. Well, okay. It's a lie. It, it does attract fans, but it doesn't make them stay. All of your favorite games fuse into one epic one, but you have to kill someone to obtain this. Mmm, once again, if I kill Isis, I'd do it. I'd do it. I, I'd kill someone from Isis. I'd do it. Okay. Uh, of course, the thing has to be obscured because, you know, shit. 
You can summon any fictional character, actor, or famous person in general, and they are all yours, and they have the relationship that you want with them. Example, spouse, partner, sibling, friend, or etc. But they only live for a year after that, and they will all mysteriously die with dildos in their arteries. Yeah, no. I mean, as I want... I mean, as I want, again, that I would like to do it, I mean, like, people live for nine months. People live for nine months. And that, and just getting three months of time spent with your wife and your child, nah, nah, man, that, that would just be bad. Like, for her, like, for the wife, I, like, I'm a guy that doesn't want to see an incomplete family. Really. I don't like that. It's it's fucking horrible. Like, no, no. You can enter any horror movie and actually survive like you always believed you could, but you'll see everyone else die. Seeing everyone else die will send you to the downward spiral and makes you the killer in the next movie. So, Dead by Daylight? Anyone? Anyone? You I mean like, sure, seeing everyone else die makes me the killer, but then again, then again, I can either be A, the killer that, like, the killer that, like, everyone runs away from, the one that's truly invincible, the one you can't kill unless you get the fuck out of there, or the guy that will resurrect even when he dies, like, you know, God Hand and all that shit. Shit. I'd say it's a good dilemma for people who don't want, who don't want to be killer, killers while at the same time, people who like playing Dead by Daylight. What? What? You think I was gonna make a video on that? Maybe if I have the money, but. <laughs> okay. All of your dreams, even the wildest ones, come true, but you die at age 2000. Okay. There is no downside to this. Think about it. Like. Okay, okay, like, see, the 20% doesn't make sense. You die at age 2000. That means you get to live, like, 109999999 years. Like, you can't wish for immortality because you'll die at age 2000, but at the same time, every single one of your dreams, even the wildest ones, come true. So basically, I can make that one story I had with a friend once. I won't specify, but, you know... It's more specified, but eh, it's a thing that I don't want to do because eh. Actually, no, I actually like what to do it, but ah, <sighs> dreams. If only they can be real. That way, I can basically make every single fictional character I know come to life. Well, every single fictional character I want to come to life. I mean, really, guys, who wants to see fucking Gilgamesh from Fate Stay Night? in their world. Nobody. Nobody. Fucking nobody. Because you will die. You will die. You will fucking die and you will have to bow to the king. And that, that, that sucks. That sucks for everyone. Okay. The next button will come true, but you have to press it. Nah. I'm not, I'm not taking a, I'm not taking a bold chance. Fuck that shit. Okay. You can stop and rewind time. But for a year, you'll have to live your worst day of your life repetitively for a year. No. Worst day of my life repetitively for a year? Nah, man. That's just, that's just, no, 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 that, that, no, no. Not even I would like that, no. Okay. You become PewDiePie, but Marcia won't have sex with you. I mean, that's fine. That's fine, like... D uh, look, I'm the only one that's like, uh, press the button and did not. Guys! As much as you, as much as you want, y you know, things to say, like, PewDiePie's a person! Like, like, you're not gonna be, like, you're not, you don't want, like, why would you press the I will not button because simply her girlfriend, uh, no, what the fuck, his girlfriend won't have sex with you. Guys, he's a person. A very popular person. I'd only do it because of his popularity. And Marcy and I can be like the best of friends. Well, not really. Like, boyfriend, girlfriend. Like, there are couples who just decide to adopt instead of, you know, doing the deed. Because, I don't know, some people are fucked up that way. But, trust me. That popularity is worth it, man. That popularity is fucking worth it. And... And 
And uh, that rant took a lot of time. So yeah, thank you so much for thank uh, thank you so much for watching. And if you can answer that, uh, well, fuck. <laughs> if you'd like to see more from from me, click the subscribe button, click the like, and comment below. What is your um? Opinion on this? Will you press the button or not? You have dashing looks, sultry voice, amazing legs, and incredible military knowledge, but you are Starscream. So basically, you're Starscream from Transformers, but you are literally the best person. Well, the perfect, a perfect robot, as you, as, as it is. So, will you press that button or not? I'd like to see that, and also I'd like to see comments pertaining to the improvement of the channel and the series as a whole. And I'll see you guys in the next video. But till then. Keep on shocking. Boop.